The topic for this year's annual lecture is fighting corruption and growing a sustainable economy, which is coming against the backdrop of economic recession and the crusade against corruption. Information Minister Lai Muhammad said more than ever before, Nigerians have come to see corruption as a major impediment to the progress of Nigeria. Countries that have consistently scored high marks in the annual corruption perception index of transparency international are also the same countries that have managed to grow a sustainable economy. Former CBN Deputy Governor Obadiah Melafia, who analyzed the subject, said corruption has robbed Nigeria of its honor and has dented the country's image before the international community. Africa alone is losing about $100 billion every year in outward hemorrhage. This amount, in fact, is enough to finance all our deficits in infrastructures. Former EFCC chairman Nuhuribadu said to fight corruption, Nigerians must reflect and change their attitude and conduct, adding that the judiciary must also cooperate. If there is one area we need national consensus, ladies and gentlemen, now it is in this supporting this effort to tackle corruption. Director General Nigerian Television Authority was represented by Executive Director Training Ibrahim Damisa. The restoration of the teaching of civics again in our schools will serve as another template for the socialization processes against corruption in this country. We look at what are the topical issues that are happening in the country and we try to uh, provide a platform for Nigerians to express their views. This year's lecture is the 11th in the series. In Abuja, Laure Balahassan, NTA News.